Welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm going to share with you this interesting website which is uh, called NSP Forwarder Generator. So, what is the what is the main uh, um, characteristic of this website? Okay, this website allows you to create your own NSP forwarder. This is very useful if you use RetroArch. And I'm going to show you a little bit what are the. I will scroll down. I will show you what are the the things that you need to know in order to use it. So here we have some. This is the main um, uh, search box. Search. No, this is a box where which you need to upload the the the. The picture that you are gonna use as an icon on your Nintendo Switch. In my case, I'm using Wolfenstein 3D. So you need the version. You can configure this. You can put whatever you want. Uh, the title of the you can leave it like that. Or you can do it random. It's up to you. The game title. So here you will write the name of the game. The publisher I wrote. In my case Nintendo but it doesn't matter those are just here these are the options that you need to make sure you have it so if you don't have it you need to type it you need to look in the in the right path in the um, you need to look on RetroArch the core path so you will you, you will have you will find here up to here but then you need to write the, the the core right the emulator let's say like that then you need to write the ROM path the ROM path is where the game is located on your SD card in my case my game is located in this directory and also you are gonna need the prod keys so you will find tons of videos on YouTube how you can get the prod keys for from the Nintendo Switch. And then the last step is just to generate the NSP. So I guess the most difficult part here is you will that you need the prod kits in order to use this website. But after all after all that I have shown you right now you are gonna be able to generate your NSP forward. I'm gonna do it right now and this is magic right there you have as you can see there Wolfenstein 3D oh and the extension is dot nsp nsp so all you need is to transfer this uh, to your SD card and that'll be all I'm not gonna show you how to install that because that's something very easy all you need is um, a whoop installer or a DVA, DVI right or good leaf something like that Okay, that'll be all for today. This is a short video just to inform you that this is very easy for you to do it. And I'll see you next time. Goodbye.